Hey, howdy, hi, this is Eli coming to you live from the Nate Nugget podcast. I hope you're having a good Thursday. I know I am because we are so, so close to one of my favorite nights of the year. I'm talking, of course, about Halloween. Everybody knows Halloween's coming right up, right quick here. Um, and so that's kind of why you just heard the song that you did, which was In the Fire by Roadrunner United. Very heavy. Uh, and we're going to keep that theme going the entire way through this next hour. We got a whole playlist, which was originally originally written by pen name Boogie Muggins over on our website at thenuggetonline.com. That's at thenuggetonline.com. Uh, head there. You can read all the articles. You can read the shuffle, uh, the actual playlist that this episode is based around, as well as all the other articles and other secret things I'll get into in a little bit here. Uh, you can find it all on our website. It's going to be a lot of fun. In the meantime, though, we can get things started with the next track, Dig Up Her Bones by The Misfits. up in a cold room yikes right you open your eyes and the first thing you're greeted with is that frosty <sighs> on your cheeks and it's just it's just ah uh, that's the worst and then you got to get up and and that awkward 30 to 45 seconds while you're rushing to put clothes on because it's just freezing in your room i forgot about how awful that is because i don't know i look at at fall through these these rose tinted glasses just way too often it's my favorite season but there's just so many little things that you don't realize bug you until they start bugging you again and it's that time of year i actually wrote a whole piece on it it's up at the nate nugget online that's the nate nugget online.com it's called the worst parts about fall and it's just all things you forgot you hated about the fall season like under overdressing uh running around picking up a last minute costume or early snow speaking of things you hate to see what a horrible night to have a curse by the black dahlia murder on nr 92. Yeah. 
listen, I got a secret for you. And you come in close. Come on. Shh, 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 shh. You got to be quiet. You can't tell anybody, okay? What if I told you I had an idea for a side hustle where you could make up to $25 for like writing 400 words? That's it. That's it. It's that easy. It's that easy. And I'm not just I'm not just saying this because I, I, I need somebody else to get in on this hustle with me. No, it's the Nate Nugget. All you got to do, show up to our pitch meetings every Tuesday at noon. The easiest way to get there is go to our Instagram, hit the link in our bio, and you're there. You're in this meeting, and me and a bunch of the other editors at the Nugget will come to you with our ideas for articles we want written. You can pick them up. We've got tons of stuff from news to sports to entertainment, uh, and I'm sure that there's something that interests just about everybody. Write about 400 words, take a picture, boom, you got a crisp $25 bill in your pocket. Well, probably not. It's all e-transfer now, and I don't even think a $25 bill exists. But anyways, Demon of the Fall by OPEC. And I don't know how
about? Everything is trash. Yeah, slow down. I don't understand. Oh my god, you don't understand. It's coming up. It's coming up. What? 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 By Blind Witness here on the Nugget Podcast on nr92.com. That one is one of my favorites. Uh, <laughs> I just love it because every single time I listen to it, the drop just it makes me think of that one meme, the blind kid playing football. If you've seen it, you know exactly what I mean. <laughs> I want to let you in on something that we did that I had a lot of fun doing. Um, and it was a little video that we here at the Nugget produced for Halloween. We want to try and get better at making videos and things and figured, well, it's the season, let's let's give it a shot. Um, I played a, a detective or, or a journalist kind of character. I don't know, it's up for, it's up <laughs> for debate. Uh, and there's a vengeful spirit in the River Valley. And I think you should probably go watch it. Easiest way to find it, of course, head over to our Instagram. That's at the Nate Nugget uh, on Instagram. Click the link in our bio. That's honestly the easiest way to find anything that we do. Link in our bio on our Instagram, at the Nate Nugget. This is Let Me In by Bray Wyatt. <laughs>
what I did. I'm really sorry for what I did. All of you forgive me. Right? We've had some really nice weather this fall, like uncharacteristically nice, like nice out of nowhere, uh, especially this last week where we had that cold spell and then right back up to those positive numbers. I know I set out all my pumpkins and then they froze and then they thawed and now they're all squishy little monsters and look nothing like what I once carved in them, but that's besides the point. What else can you do this fall? Well. There's actually quite a few things you could be doing right now. Um, I would know. I wrote an article on it. It's it's live at thenuggetonline.com, uh, and it's called Six Things to Do This Fall. So, like what, you may ask? Well, you could try and visit uh, either Fort Edmonton Dark or Dedmonton Haunted House, both really great options if you want to get scared. Uh, that being said, tickets are really, really sold out. Uh, for both. There's some online events with Dark that you can still sign up for, and then Dedmonton Haunted House, uh, while all pre-sale online tickets are sold out, uh, you can still pick some up at the door uh, on the hour, every hour, every night that they're open. And they're open until, I believe, the uh, 13th of November. So lots to do. You could go for walks in the river valleys or visit a corn maze, anything like that. We got Conqueror All by Behemoth.
you ever find yourself and your friends arguing over esports? <laughs> like whether or not they really count as sports, it's tough. It's it's really tough. It's something that that mankind has has debated over for millennia. But we finally are one step closer to an answer thanks to a glorious piece uh, that was co-written by Oren Ferris and Scott Zielsdorf, the sports and issues editors, respectively. Um, Oren is a self-proclaimed rugby hooligan and hoop head, whereas <laughs> Scott sees himself as a bird keeper and League of Legends fanatic. Uh, they both have very different opinions on whether or not esports and professional video games count as an actual sporting event or not. Um, and the article brings up a lot of really good points on what constitutes a sport, what is required to make something an Olympic event versus this or that, um, and it's written in a really interesting way that I haven't seen in a while, but the way they wrote it was um, Oren would write his first blurb, kind of introducing his side, Scott followed doing the same, and then they sent this document back and forth to each other, writing out paragraph or two responses back and forth uh, until they finally reached a decision on whether or not esports could be qualified as a sport. Definitely go check it out. Take a look. Let us know what you think, whether or not it can be qualified as a sport. Coming up right about now, Ramirez by the Acacia Strain. <laughs>
Slicer Exerciser by Whitechapel here on the Nugget podcast. That one draws heavily from Jack the Ripper. Um, that whole album does, really. But uh, that song kind of details the transition from hunt to kill to dismemberment. It's gnarly. And that just about wraps it up for this episode of the Nugget podcast uh damn shame because this is a good one i had a lot of fun uh listening to these tunes because i don't know just something really heavy uh, driving anything like that right before halloween it's just just perfect but maybe there was a little a little much for you maybe it was it was it was a bunch uh a lot all at once we've got a couple of songs coming up just to kind of cool you down they're still a little spookier a little to the theme but definitely a little easier i'll throw those on in just a minute right now i'm just gonna say goodbye uh it's been good happy to be here and i'll be here again next week same time four o'clock every thursday um and i'll have a brand new playlist brand new stories brand new topics so in the meantime make sure go read a couple of the articles i talked out read a couple of the ones i didn't uh go and watch our short that we produced tell my truth over on it's on the nugget youtube channel but you can find it easily through our instagram page at the nate nugget on instagram hit the link in the bio you can't miss it now to cool you off we've got two songs uh and the writer of this playlist recommended that you listen to these on repeat until uh you are alleviated from all terror and dread this is the Living Tombstones remix of Spooky, Scary Skeletons, a classic. And then, of course, Astronomina by Huts, or better known as The Coffin Dance. See you next week. Bye! <laughs>